first one. Ah. Remind me to turn that back on, Gabby, or else they'll pick you up in, um... Apex. Apex. Oh, great! Don't want that to happen. <laughs> I need help. Wait, give me some leaking back on real quick. Oh, because you can use it. Oh, I can't see something. If you can use it through the... Yeah, I can use it. Sweet. It is so weird. Nice. I, I just can't use my, the ID because I guess it's in something then. Okay. How can I... Please don't call myself. You, you can't hear the audio from the...
To all agents, the break room refrigerator will be cleaned out on Friday. Please remove all personal items. This includes condiments, lunch containers, and the frozen Hitler brain. Thank you. Okay, in turn, let me just set up your camera monitoring system. Here we go. Oh, nice. I'll be doing surveillance for a water park. Awesome. Oh, no, 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 no. These are cameras attached to bidets. You've got bidets for days. <laughs> That's a good one. Anyway, have fun with the crapper cams. <laughs> No, I'm just saying a tweezer cam is gross. Yeah, but we have to inspect nostril trackers. One aggressive nose pick and it's out of place. Hello, we've been watching you. Wait, that sounded weird. We've been watching you and now we're sharing your secrets with the public. Hmm, not much better. Uh, oh well. We made a game out of all this info and we call it... Espionage. We go. First up. I don't know. How about What percentage of people have gone on juice cleanses? Think carefully. You want to be as close as possible to the actual percentage to get the most points. It, 35%. Okay, everyone else, time to guess if the actual percentage is higher or lower. Mm -hmm. I hear you. Just one of you is saying higher. And Surveil says... 7%! And every single one of them talked about it non-stop. Who said lower? Ooh, points for you! Next. I hear you. We've collected data about everything, even this. What percentage of people walk around art museums with their hands clasped behind their backs? Six percent. Okay, higher or lower? <laughs> One of you thinks it's higher, and the correct answer is twenty-two percent. Excellent answer. Points for you. Who got it right? Well done. You get points. Next up. All right, buckle in. I've got one for you. What percentage of people have taken in stray animals as pets? Forty-three percent. All right, what do you think? Just one person says lower. Okay, let's see the right answer. 47%! Ooh, just a few percentage points off. Well done. Let's see who got it right. Here's some points. Okay, who's up next? <laughs> oh, here's one we've been especially interested in. Don't ask why. Yes. 
what percentage of people exit parties without telling people they're leaving? Twenty-five percent. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Everyone says higher. And the correct answer is... 25%! You nailed it. Now don't get a big head, but I think you're perfect. You get all the points for this one. Sorry, everyone else. Let's see who's in the lead after round one. I hear you. Mm-hmm. Time for round two. Who's up first? I'm going to search for... What percentage of people still listen to music using iPods? Got it, 62%. In round two, you can double down if you think the guess is off by 15% or more. Just pick much higher or much lower. If you're correct, you're mama's little angel. You get double the points. I hear you. It's unanimous again. Okay, right answer is... 26%. Terrible guess. You need to be within 30% to even get points. Who got it right? Well done. You get points. Next up. I hear you. Here's a spicy one for you. When given the choice of mild, medium, or hot salsa, what percentage of people choose hot? What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Okay, let's see the right answer. 24%! Hey, you're a better guesser than our trained rats. Nice job. Let's see who got it right. Smart, yes. Here's your points. Who's next? Oh, this is gonna be good. What percentage of people have non-ear body piercings? Thirty-eight percent. Everyone else, higher or lower? One person says lower. Now let's get to the right answer. 12%? Um, no, I don't want to see yours.
Hey, did we ever get those results about whether cult members like chunky or smooth peanut butter? No, all of our field agents keep getting discovered and converted. Ugh, I'm just going to say chunky then. Whoa, what the? What does that mean? Oh, that's right, you're new here. Ah, it's just a nuclear event drill. We have them every month or so. Where where do we go? Ah, down to the bunker. What are you doing? Is, is that scuba gear? Ah, kind of. Mm-hmm. Ah, you should have a tank, a mask, and a regulator in the bottom of your file you. cabinet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Explain, please. Well, the stairs down to the bunker go 100 meters below sea level. Air's really thin down there. Well, and make sure you come back up slow. Don't want to get the bends, right? I don't think I can do this. I have a fear of depth. I'm depth-phobic. Ah, uh, in that case, I would just hide under your desk. Hopefully the boss won't take a head count. Oh, good luck. Hey, Sheila, what are you doing with those classified folders you're leaving the building with? It's not what you think. These are gag folders. See, it says classified. Yeah, because you crossed out classified and wrote that yourself with a sharpie. I outrank you. I don't need to explain. Sure, it's your tax dollars. Let's start another game of... Gespionage! Okay, who's first? (laughs) All right, Surveillance Pro, what do you have for this? What percentage of people have performed the whip and or nene dance routine? We have an answer. 45%. Everyone else, now it's your turn. Do you think the correct answer is higher or lower? One lonely vote for lower. And Surveil says... 20%! And I'm sure every single one of them nailed it. Let's see who got it right. Nice job! I've got some points for you. Okay, who's up next? Ooh, the president asked us to look this up yesterday. What percentage of people are superstitious about blowing out all their birthday candles in one breath? You're almost at 25%. Everyone else, higher or lower? says higher except for one of you. Okay, let's see the right answer. 42%! Mmm, I'll take a slice with your spit, please. Who got it right? Here's some points! Next up! I hear you! Let's see, what would be good? How about this? What percentage of people consider their signatures to be very legible? Sixteen percent. Everyone pick, higher or lower. Only one of you thinks it's higher. Okay, let's see the right answer. Nineteen percent! I've got big points for that guess. Let's see who got it right. Nice job, I've got some points for you. Okay, who's up next? 
Typey, typey. What percentage of people have seen seven or more Fast and Furious movies? Twenty-two percent. Okay, higher or lower? I hear you. Everyone is saying lower, and the correct answer is eleven percent. They're the reason why there will be a thirty-second, thirty-third, and thirty-fourth movie. Who got it right? Well done. You get points. Let's see where things stand after round one. I hear you. Not bad, but things are a little different in round two. I'll explain as we go. Let's start with you. Okay, computer, what do you have for this one? What percentage of people have spare keys hidden somewhere outside their homes? Okay, we have a guess. Fifty percent. Everyone else, do you think the correct answer is higher or lower? It's unanimous again. Okay, right answer is... 18%! God love these people, it makes our job so much easier. Let's see who got it right. Well done, you get points. And what have we here? Good job! Double points for saying much lower. Who's next? What should I search for in the old Surveillance Pro next? Ooh, I know! What percentage of men prefer electric razors as their go-to face shaving device? Thirty-eight percent. Everyone pick, higher or lower. Just one person says lower, and the correct answer is... 38%! Whoa, you got it exactly right! What are the chances? I try to find that out, but I don't have my graphing calculator with me. Sorry everyone, Genius here gets all the points. Next up... I hear you. Ooh, I remember seeing good surveillance for this yesterday. What percentage of people own a pair of Crocs? Twenty-three percent. Everyone else, higher or lower? One of you is saying higher. Now let's get to the right answer. 18%! Dang, you nailed that guess. You got it right. Here's some points. Okay, who's up next? I'll bet our database has some juicy data for this. What percentage of people currently own aquariums? Eight percent. What do y'all think? Higher or lower? Time's 
running out, higher or lower? I hear you. Ooh, everyone thinks it's higher. And Surveil says... 10%! Whoa, you only missed the actual percentage by 2%. Nice work. Let's see who got it right. Mark, yes, here's your points. Uh-oh, final round time. Through sophisticated population profiling, we found the most popular answers to this question. What do most people think is the quintessential Beatles song? Let's see what people think. But only the top three answers will get you points. Ready, go! Okay, let's see what you picked. And what are the most popular answers? Who's that special someone? My, my, seeing this game played like you did really warms my cockles. Did you know 76% of people don't even know what cockles are? Data collection? No, we don't have Prince Albert and Akina. And Tom, I know it's you. Hey, you guys going to lunch soon? Yeah. You know, we should invite the new guy. We should. I can't remember his name, though. I can't either. I haven't met him yet. I think it was Chris. No. Something like Chris. Craig, Kyle, Crinkle. Kevin, Comfy, Quicksilver, Condoleezza, Con uh, uh, Quail Egg. Yeah. Go say, hey, Quail Egg, want to go to lunch? Corky, Condiment? Christmas. How about just walking over and saying, Hey, I'm Warren. I'm sorry, but I can't remember your name. Can you say Christmas, but sort of mutter it so he thinks you said his name? Sure. And if it's wrong, I'll just tell him Brian said that was his name. Right. Hey, Chris Eminen, and I hate you guys. What does that mean? That's the alarm that goes off when the world's man bun population has eclipsed 15%. What do we do? We head to the basement and we wait it out. Okay, everybody, file out in an orderly manner. Remain calm. Yeah, so if you could ask her to call me back at the field office.
KO. I am the Tournament Master, so if you see a coffee mug that says World's Greatest Tournament Master, do not use it. That is clearly my mug. History's greatest t-shirt warriors train their entire lives to make it to T-Shirt Island, which is why I'm extra sorry I didn't clean up before you got here. Just kick aside the bones of our last contestants and we'll get started. Welcome to the training grounds. You will use your device to draw three drawings. Draw something cute, something gross, something funny. Honestly, I don't care what you draw, but if you need help, hit the suggestion button. It's time for your first drawing, right now. Those of you watching the tournament don't have to wait another hundred years to get in on the fun. Join the audience to submit suggestions and affect the game. Time is not for decoration, finish quickly! Excellent, this time show me something different. Remember to use the suggestion button if you need an idea. Begin drawing two.
Only seconds remain. Gorgeous. One more to go. Wow, my babies. Begin. Time runs out! Hmm, yes, I think we can work with these. For your last exercise, you will write as many slogans or phrases as you can. These have nothing to do with your drawing, so just put those out of your mind. And there's no shame in hitting the suggestion button if you need it. You didn't give up after one, did you? Keep writing! Time goes short, hurry up and finish already! Oh yes, this is gonna be good. Your training is at an end. Now take note of your device. Select one drawing and one slogan to create the perfect t-shirt combination. And I do mean perfect.
You may want to finish up. Good. I can wait no longer. Let the tournament begin. Goblin 1 Versus Fight. Fight by submitting your votes on your devices, that is. Fight each other! Challenger appears. Battle. Fight for me, baby. Fight.
A new challenger appears. Fart! A new challenger appears. Engage in an altercation. Winners! Oh, I need a breather. Let's take a training break. Use your devices to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans as you wish. I want you to know, I believe in you. Go! If you didn't qualify for the tournament, don't fret. Simply join the audience to submit your suggestions and vote on your favorite shirts. Time goes short, hurry up and finish already! And right!
that time is not for decoration. Finish quickly. The second gauntlet awaits, and the slimy tentacles of destiny have shuffled your drawings and slogans. Forge a new t-shirt champion! about that, hmm? Well, we'll see. Got the two. Versus. I want you to fight. A new challenger appears. Fine. A new challenger appears. Attack! A new challenger appears. Attack! A new challenger appears. Battle!
a new challenger appears. Fight! Versus. Go ahead and fight already. Winners! So it's come to this, the final gauntlet. Only the strongest shirts from the previous rounds will compete, and only one will come out alive. Versus Fight As tournaments go, that was up there. Uh, did anyone tape that? Uh, get me a copy, okay? I'll give you a blank VHS. <laughs>